Hey guys, it's Nikki and Elmer with Eat, Try, Unbox and today we are here in Hacienda Heights. We're back because they got so much good food and we're going to be trying Higo Express which is a Japanese and Peruvian food restaurant. So let's check out the menu. So the food looks kind of good. They have saltado which Elmer likes. I don't know how to say that. Chafa? Ta tayarin saltado? I thought it was taha. Yeah, okay. Tayarin saltado. They have a bunch of it's special rolls. Um, but I guess it's basically a mix of Peruvian food and Japanese food, obviously. Um, ceviche, gyoza, higo tacos. That one sounds good. I think we're gonna try that. So we ordered the lomo saltado with beef and the tajarin saltado with shrimp. And we got the higo tacos. I forgot what it was though. Tuna? It's like raw tuna with gyoza skin but it's like wrapped in like a taco kind of shape and it smells delicious it smells really good in this car you want to be here <laughs> the green salad Ooh, that's spicy that smells spicy i'm not gonna try that i'm sure it'll be good but... i'm sure it's better without it Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, look at that that smells so good that looks so good did you see the steam i'm sure you didn't but it was steaming that's like hella meat and then like a half a cup of rice you know people in this comment section are like oh yeah like the portion sizes are small but actually i think these portion sizes are big and how much was it i think it was like nine dollars nine ninety five each nine something almost ten Ooh, so this is damn. the shrimp tahrin saltado yo we got the beast bro okay. so i guess it's like interesting how there's like peruvian food mixed with japanese i'm not sure what is what like what makes it Japanese, but I'm, yeah, I'm not sure what makes it Japanese. Other than like maybe the noodles or whatever, but I heard a story that like this is originally from China or like Chinese like origin, but maybe it's just both of like Asian countries like coming to Peru and like mixing with the culture there. <gasps> it was good too, savory, fresh. Yep, fresh. I take that. I'm trying to identify the flavors, but I really can't. All I know is it tastes good. I guess I'll describe what's in here. There's some red onions, um, grilled tomatoes, obviously noodles, shrimp. Mine has rice and fries and onions and tomatoes and then the beef and some sauce to it. It's really good. That looks so good. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's too hot. I was reading the menu and I know that um, this saltado is like flavored with vinegar and soy sauce. And I think that's pretty much what it tastes like. Potatoes are great. If you've never had this before, absolutely recommend trying it. This is good. So my tongue, I recently burned my tongue um, like five days ago and it's still recovering. Like this is the worst burn I've ever had on my tongue. So I can't really enjoy the food in the way I'd like to because um, it kind of hurts. And so I don't think I can really give you a description of the taste um, accurately. Like it does definitely tastes savory. It definitely tastes fresh. It's, um, I don't know. It's yeah, good. It's just like savory, salty. Um, I can see pepper on it and like obviously it tastes peppery. But all I can describe it is just, yeah, it just tastes good. You know, so it came with soy sauce, but I think I just want to try it without. I want to try it the flavor that it has by itself. Okay, so what we got on here? It's like tuna, sesame seeds, looks like some uh, avocado, green onions. And then it has like a really interesting like taco and it's gyoza. Mm. Wow, that's good. It's a little spicy. A little spicy, yeah. It has a nice like salt flavor to it. Uh. Ah. <laughs> Hold on. Mm. Hold it. It's actually like pretty salty, but not in a bad way. It's like, like a bunch of like soy sauce. 
it's spicy. So I asked the girl at the front, I said, is this spicy? She goes, eh, a little bit. But a little bit to other people is a lot to me. No, it's fire. Literally. Mm. All right, I'd give this like an 7.5 out of 10. Some, like maybe an eight too. I, I'll be real, like I think I've had like more flavorful saltados before, but like this is definitely good, especially for the price and like how much food you get. Look at that, ooh, what's up? Look at that. Steak. I give it a, I think I give it like a 7.5 or an eight. Uh, maybe 7.5. Like I think all I want more out of it is like more sauce, more flavor. I want, I actually want it to kind of be like drenched a little bit more. I think I agree, more, more flavor. Nothing wrong with it right now, it's just, if you added more, it'd be really good. Like we've had this Lomo Saltado um, somewhere else before. And I think that's where we were first introduced to it. And that was really, really good, right? Like yeah. that was like probably the best place. We've had it somewhere else too, but that very first location that we tried, that was the best one. Yeah, I would just like the flavor to be like richer. I and mean, really that's just all about like putting more sauce in it. But other than that, like it's really good. All right, so that's the review we've got for Higo Express. Um, where have you guys tried other Peruvian Japanese fusion spots? Um, let us know in the comments below. We'd love to try it out. And if you're in Hacienda Heights, recommend us something in here. I know there's a lot of good food here, but if you've already been here, you've eaten here, like let us know so we can try something out. All right, bye. See ya.